right, this is a review for input output tables. And you've been doing input output tables for a while. And they look something like this, where you might have um, like the number of triangles and then the number of sides. Okay. So you have something on one side and then something on the other. Okay. So oh, triangles. So then if you have one triangle, you have three sides, right? Two triangles, six sides. Um, and like one triangle, three sides, two triangles, six sides, three triangles, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine sides, four triangles, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve sides. Okay? The thing with input output tables is I like to think of them as a machine. Okay? So I am going to actually down here, I'm uh, just kind of entertain myself by drawing an input output machine. Okay? Um, so um, I'm going to make mine uh, a really cool looking one. Feel free to make yours however you like it. Um, Alright, let's see. And then uh, maybe it'll come over here and go like that. Okay. Alright, so the idea with an input output machine is you put something in and you get something out. Okay? So with the case of my triangles and sides, if I put in the number of triangles, so one triangle, if I put a one in, then it goes through the machine. And it comes out and it tells you three sides. Okay? And yes, it has to make that sound effect. And if you put the number two in, so two triangles, then you get the number six out, okay? And so um, this machine is going to always give you out um, a different number based on whatever you put in. And in the case of triangles and sides, what this machine is doing is multiplying by three. Right? Because one goes in, three comes out. Two goes in, six comes out. Three goes in, nine comes out. Okay? And so the thing that we notice is that tables have rules. Tables have rules. Okay? Okay? And then the rule for the table, okay? The rule for the table is like the function, or what the machine does, the function of the machine. Okay? All right. Okay, so the rule for the table is like the function of the machine, and the function is what the machine does. Okay? Um, so I'm actually going to make myself a little note of that down here. So um, the function is what the machine does. Okay, and that's just kind of a little note. Okay, because um, they might ask, like, that's just a word that you want to start knowing. Okay, and um, so tables, the other thing to know is that tables and input-output machines can be, and there's two different types okay, for the most part, they can be additive, okay, Additive, okay, which means adding, or multiplicative, 
multiplicative. And I think I'm going to go over my words over here. Okay, so they either add or they multiply. Okay, um, and like I mean like add or subtract or multiply or divide, but in general we describe them as being either additive or multiplicative. Okay, so like in our example here, this is a times three machine. So we're multiplying, so this is a multiplicative machine. Okay, and that is your review of input output.